insectivorous plants. Though most plants make their own food, some of them have devised other ways of getting food. Even though these plants are green, they grow in soils which are poor in minerals. So, to supplement the lack of minerals, they eat insects. Such plants are called insectivorous plants. These plants grow in the wild. They are not cultivated. Pitcher plant The leaf of a pitcher plant grows into a long, hollow tube. The tip of the leaf grows like a lid. The hollow tube is filled with a liquid. The lid of the plant is very colourful and emits a sweet smell. The insects get attracted as they climb inside the leaf to look for nectar. They slip down the tube and drown in the liquid. The plant then feeds on them. Sundew The sundew has hairy leaves. Insects are caught in the sticky drops on the tips of the hairs. The plant slowly feeds on the softer parts of the insects and the hard parts get blown away in the wind. Venus Fly trap. The leaves of the Venus flytrap are divided into two halves. The edges of the leaves have sharp bristles. When an insect lands on them, the two halves snap together and hold the insect inside. The leaves secrete a juice which digests the insect. Once the insect gets eaten, the two lobes open, ready to catch its next prey. Fungi We often see some whitish or bluish substance on food items which have been left out in the open for a day or two. Also, during the monsoon months, this whitish bluish thing starts appearing on leather articles like shoes, belts and bags as well as on wood. This is fungi. As fungi have no chlorophyll at all, they cannot prepare their own food. They have root-like structures which absorb nutrition from the substances on which they grow. Now, take a piece of apple or a slice of bread and put it in a glass jar. Close the lid very tightly. Prick three or four tiny holes in the lid for the air to enter the jar. Observe it very carefully over a few days and notice the changes. When the entire fruit or bread is covered with fungi, throw the jar. Precautions Always wear gloves while touching fungi. Wash your hands with soap and water afterwards. Though mushroom is a fungus, we eat it. But not all mushrooms are edible. Some of them are very poisonous. Wasn't it interesting to know about these unusual plants?